Hey, what's up Aquamigos? How are you guys doing today? It's me Tobias here and it's, man, it's been, I don't know how the time is passing so quickly, but it's been a while since I've uploaded a video. Again, I've just been super busy, but we're finally going to be continuing with some work on the koi pond. And check these guys out. They're like, they're eager for food. I gotta feed them. By the way guys, if you saw my last video, my dad and I, we set up these security cameras. We got two on the ponds and we have two looking out to the front of the house. This is one right here. They are by the brand Uniark. We have the other one over here. I still have to do a better job of concealing the wires. I'll do that really soon. And Uniark actually just sent me the hard drive for this camera system. I actually received the package just before I started recording this video. Let me show you guys that real quick. Here we go right here guys, cameras in the front of the house. And then of course the two pond cameras. And this right here is the hard drive which I just received. I'm gonna install that really soon so I can finally record with this system. But for now I'm just gonna be continuing with the pond. Um, so let's go to get out there and start doing some stucco work. All right guys, here I am mixing up some stucco. I was actually surprised that this stucco was still good. I've left it outside for quite a while, including like one time when it was raining, but I had it covered up so it was all good. And then I totally forgot to mask off the pond liner, so I went ahead and did that really quick before I started applying the stucco. And I didn't have that much of an area that I needed to do. This was just kind of like the last bare spot that I had to cover up. And then of course I had to clean off the area and this is a water sprayer right here. I'm using it to spray down the bricks before I apply the stucco. And then right here, I'm doing a sponge float to kind of give it that texture that I want. The sponge really helps bring out the graininess in the stucco. And then there are some pretty large parts around the perimeter of the pond where I didn't do the texture. I just applied stucco because I wasn't really sure what texture I was going for yet. So I have to go over it again with another layer of stucco to give it that texture that I want. All right guys, so right now, as you can see, I'm trying to texturize some of the smooth stucco parts that I did before, before I really settled on like the kind of stucco finish that I wanted. So I still pretty much have to do this entire middle section right here and then that entire middle section over there. And then of course I have to do these vertical top sides like right here. I already did like the bottoms, but I gotta do these top parts to kind of blend that all together. I just had to clean off my tools really quick. Um, it's already just about 6 p.m. So it's probably gonna get dark pretty soon, but I'm still gonna try to do like at least one small section before it gets dark.
All right, guys, so I pretty much got the whole back finished. There's just one more little spot over there that I didn't get because I ran out of um, stucco. And then I pretty much just need to texture this whole part right here from like there to there. And then I'll be able to start on the, you know, this part all the way around. Oh geez, I almost forgot to take that masking tape off. All right guys, now I'm finished for the day. It's hard to get the lighting right. The It's it's starting to get dark now, so the lighting is all weird. But I was just thinking to myself, um, how this entire summer I was like saying to myself, oh, I'm gonna finish the pond before the end of the summer. I'm gonna finish the pond before the end of the summer. Like I kept saying that, and now it's the end of the summer and I haven't finished. So yeah, it's a little unfortunate, but it's just the way it went, you know? I really thought I would finish before the summer was over. I didn't. And that's just the way it is, you know? I wish I had finished during the summer. That would have been cool. But uh, anyways, guys, I'm gonna try to upload more frequently. The videos might be a little shorter, but hopefully I'll at least upload a little more frequently. So anyways, as usual, guys, I'd like to give a huge shout out to the Aquamigos. Thank you guys so much for the support. I really do appreciate it. If any of you guys would like a shout out in one of my upcoming videos, all you have to do is leave a comment down below with the word Aquamigo in it. It could be anything you want, as long as it has the word Aquamigo. And of course, if you did like this video, I'd really appreciate it if you went down there and gave this video a like if you'd like to see more of my videos in the future make sure to hit that subscribe button and also that bell notifications button i'll go ahead and put my instagram right here which is also my tiktok make sure to follow me there as well oh man mosquitoes are everywhere and i'll talk to you guys in my next video peace